Hey Diva Dolls, I'm coming to you with a video response. I was tagged by Miss QT Style, and the tag, the name of the tag is Holiday Cheer is Here Tag. Um, so I wanted to go ahead and participate really quickly before I got started in my work, and um, I'm excited about answering these questions, so I'm going to get straight into it, okay? Um, there are 16 questions, and I will tag anybody that's watching this video response. You are it. Please join in on the tag. Um, the first question is, what is your most memorable Christmas gift as a child? Uh, my most memorable gift as a child um, was a Barbie doll house that I had to have. Um, and I thought I was going to get the wide Barbie doll house, and I ended up getting the tower. And it was literally, it had to be over four feet tall. Um, so that was one of the most exciting, memorable, memorable gifts I ever received as a child. Um, so that's question number one. And then I'm trying to get my eyes. Please excuse me. But anyway, um, number two is what is your favorite holiday dish or meal? Uh, I don't really have a special holiday dish other than mac and cheese. Um, I really love macaroni. I love cheese. So macaroni and cheese is probably um, the main thing other than the meat when I um, fix my dish for the holiday. Um, I know it's normal. You can fix it on Sunday, but I love mac and cheese. So that is my favorite dish for the holiday. Um, number three, if you could name Santa's newest reindeer, what would, her, what would him or her name be? Um, it would be a her, and I would name her Chili. She'd be chilling in the cut, not doing much, pulling her weight, and hanging with the rest of them. So that would be my, my name of my newest member for Santa, Chili. Um, number four, pine tree or artificial tree? Um, I'm going to go with artificial tree. Even though I love the smell of pine and it's Christmassy and all, but they're a fire hazard and they're messy. So I'm going to go with artificial. Um, number five, besides your family, if you could spend Christmas with anyone, who would it be? Um, and I would say I would like to spend Christmas with a family that's less fortunate than I. Um, because there's always someone out there that's in a not good of a state, you know. And you, I want to be able to share the joy and experience with a family that that are struggling. And then you have kids and um Sorry about that. I got interrupted. I'm here at work. Um, but again, um, spending time with a family and just seeing them, seeing the children open their gifts um, that are less fortunate than my than my girls. That I would really like to see the joy and um, excitement on their faces. So that would be my choice um, of spending it with other than my own family. Um, Number six, name two things you want to change for the new year. Um, kind of got three. One and two can go together. Um, one and two would be eating healthy and exercise, and those are a must for me. Um, just trying to get my body right, trying to do be healthier, and that's key for me. So those kind of go hand in hand. And then if I could choose the third or say the second um, goal for me would be to um, – get tighter with my budget so I can save money. So those are the kind of combo two things slash third thing that I need to be um, more focused on on my goal for the upcoming year. Um, <laughs> number seven, what is on my wish list for Christmas? I don't really have a wish list, but it would be really nice if my daughter gets me a Kindle Fire. I love to read and um, she had mentioned getting a nook, but hopefully my mini, mini me has um, passed along the word to get a Kindle Fire instead. Um, other than that, um, it's all about the kids for me, um, so it is what it is. Whatever I get, I'm thankful. I'm truly blessed for that. Um, let's see. Number eight. Did you find any Black Friday deals on Christmas gifts? Um, no. Well, actually, I went to Old, Old Navy um, Thanksgiving night around midnight, and the line was wrapped around the building. Um, however, um, 
I did get some stuff for, for her and then I got I found her a DS for $99 at Walmart and I got her a few games so I did a little bit of some something, something but it wasn't a majorly overly exciting um, deal not like I expected um, so not really uh, let's see white lights are multicolored lights I am going to say multicolored lights I think the white lights are beautiful they're really Christmassy but I'm all about colors so I'm gonna go with um, call the multicolor lights. My eyes keep watering, so excuse me, y'all. Um, let's see. Number ten, sing a verse of your favorite Christmas carol. Literally. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Okay, I'm not a singer, so I got that out of the way real quick. Um, number 11, star, angel, or a bow on the top of your tree. I'm going to go with a star. That's what we have on top of our tree right now. Um, I like the bow. That's pretty, and I love the angel. Um, but I agree with Miss QT Style on this one, too, about getting a black angel. Um, not being color struck, but just it would be nice if black family, black angel. Anyway, I'm going with a star. Um, number 12, um, give the Christmas Scrooge Grinch some convincing words to change his mind about Christmas. Um, my words to him, I mean, literally would, would be to get it together, Scrooge. Life is short. Um, tomorrow isn't guaranteed. Um, do something for somebody and, um, enjoy that feeling. Stop being so mad and so, so ugly all the time. Those would be my words to the Scrooge. Um, let's see. Number 13. Have you been naughty or nice for 2012? I believe I've been pretty good. I've been nice. Um, I'm pretty much in the same all the time. Um, I can get moody, but I'm never naughty or I don't think I've caused any chaos this year. Um, so I will say I've been nice. Um... Number 14, if you were standing in the living room when Santa comes tumbling down your chimney, what would you say to him? Um, you want some cookies and milk? Because you're good at not going the door. That would be my words to him. Um, number 15, if you were giving five, given five minutes to grab whatever you want for free in Walmart for Christmas, what would some of the items you would grab? I would grab as much of the cosmetics. Yes, I would hard candy and all. Um, I would get that stuff from moi, but I would also make it on over to the kids clothing section and rack up on the skinny jeans, different colors for my little mini mini me. Um, and probably pick up a couple of blouses for myself. And I mean, I'd be real quick about it. Five minutes, oh, I wouldn't have no problems. Try me. But anyway, those would be the gifts that I would, the things that I would grab in Walmart if I had five minutes. And number 16, what type of alcohol do you spike your eggnog, um, your eggnog with? I use um, any type of brandy. Um, I try not to get the can with the alcohol already in it because that's too harsh. And then you end up adding more eggnog. So um, I fix it to my liking. I get the regular eggnog out of the store, but I mix it with... Um, Cavassier, brown, any brand, any kind of brandy is really, really good in it. And I don't put too much just because I like the sweetness in it myself. Um, but want a little oomph in it. Yeah, I use brandy. So thank you for tagging me, Miss QT Style. It's greatly appreciated to be a part of this tag. So I am tagging anyone that's watching this in this Christmas tag, which is called Holiday Cheer is Here Tag. Um, Thank you all. Hopefully you all had a great Thanksgiving and looking forward to a blessing, merry, merry Christmas, and a happy new year. And thank you all for watching. Bye.